All right, it's time. I've been grinding for a long time. Y'all know that. And it's time I achieve one of my long lost goals. All right, I want 100,000 subscribers on YouTube. I'm a little more than 30,000 away. So please, Pharaohs, help me run my sub count up in the month of September. If you watch this video, please subscribe to my channel. I want to hit 30,000 subscribers in one month to get to 100K. Again, we can do this, Pharaohs. I trust in my Pharaohs. Y'all didn't help me down and pay my bills for over a year. And I know we can do this together. We've been through a lot. The grind ain't never stopped. And we going forward in the month of September. I need about 30,000 subscribers in the month of September to achieve this goal. I'm going to grind my behind off to get to it. I know we got it in us. Thank y'all so much for the time, love, support. We finna do something amazing and have our moment. By the end of September, 30,000 subscribers in one month. Let's go. Go. All right, I'm with Telefero, Mr. Telefero TV. All right, so bad, 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 all bad news for the Lil Wayne fans out there, or just humans. And, and nobody wants to see anybody uh, physically suffer any type of harm to their body. A rep for Wayne's camp confirms that Lil Wayne had multiple seizures while he was in Chicago on Sunday, and he was found unconscious in a hotel room at the West End on Michigan Avenue. All right. He suffered one seizure in the hotel, and then after that, he was rushed to the Northwestern Memorial Hospital, where we were told he suffered another seizure. All right, our sources say that the team tried to have him discharged late Sunday afternoon so he could make his show in Las Vegas. However, doctors advised against the discharge, saying he should be grounded for a few days, chill, just kind of rest up in Chicago. All right, again, Wayne has suffered seizures flying before. He suffered seizures on multiple occasions, and a lot of people believe it's because Wayne can't get off that lane. It's simple as that, and I'm not the guy that to go in this long, well-thought-out, uh, sympathetic video about Lil Wayne. The reality of the situation is Wayne got to hop off the lane, bro. And ain't no if, fans, buts about it. I don't know him personally, never met the guy, but Wayne got to hop off the lane. It's, it's as simple as that. Now, I was actually at the ludicrous celebrity basketball game yesterday in Atlanta, and Toya Wright, Wayne's ex, and his daughter, Regina Carter, were both present at the game. Um, that was late in the afternoon. Obviously, they looked in good spirits. Obviously, I don't know personally if they already knew Wayne had had those seizures or had had the seizure and was unconscious in the room. Of course, you don't bring that up to somebody at a game, but it didn't seem like their spirits or their morale was down. So maybe they found out later after the game. That was yesterday afternoon. Again, very unfortunate situation. Lil Wayne has had more seizures. He was found unconscious in his room. Man, Wayne, my brother, people can't feel sorry for you until you take care of yourself. You got to hop off that drink. And Wayne's an OG lean drinker. So think about it. Wayne's only like 34, 35, but he's been around for two decades. So, I mean, you, you got to put that in perspective. And we haven't really seen legacies of lean drinkers. Remember, this drink became popular in the 90s and 2000s. We ain't seen legacies of lean drinkers like this. So we don't know the effects. We've obviously heard stories about the pimp C's of the world. But we don't really know the long-term effects. And again, Wayne's an OG lean drinker. So he's one of the first we're really actually seeing have impact from drinking his lean. Again, prayers to Lil Wayne, of course, and his family. But Lil Wayne. This is real. His rep has already confirmed it. Lil Wayne has had seizures because he was drinking that. Well, we don't know if he was drinking a lean, but he has had seizures and he was found unconscious. One can assume it was because maybe a drug. And his Vegas show, he had a show in Vegas with Ray Shrummett. It was canceled because Wayne couldn't make it. All right. Good luck, Wayne. Good, get well soon. Thank you for the time and support. But Wayne, you got to hop off that lean. Pharaohs. Subscribe to my channel for more exclusive content like this. 100K game, we on the way. We want to do it by the end of September. 100,000 subscribers. Salute. I'm out. I want to salute you, homie, you know, for, for building your own thing and doing your own thing, creating your own platform, your own website. I got one life to live out my dreams, and I'm giving this thing all I got. I interview celebrities. I talk sports. I represent the culture. Right now, you're turning up on MrTalaferro.com, shawty.